last, the puncture. Now, that's a real nuisance on a motorbike, especially when you're miles away from the nearest garage. Now, on an ordinary bike, the front wheel is between the tines of a fork, like this. And even with the right tools, it can take you well over half an hour to change it. But on this bike, there isn't a fork. There's a single strong shaft, and the wheel is just a rim which attaches to a triangular plate behind the disc brake here. All of this is fixed to the single shaft, and suspension is achieved by making this part flexible. It means I can carry a spare wheel with me on the bike, and that yep. makes wheel changing a matter of a few minutes. There's even an air reservoir stored in the shaft in case the spare tire needs to be pumped up. I think it's a very good idea and it could make changing wheels on a motorbike as straightforward as it is on a car. But a little bit further ahead, there is something that even this bike won't be able to cope with. 